Hi, I'm Brian Campanotti. I'm the Chief Technology Officer of Front Porch Digital, and I uh, want to talk to you today about Div Archive version 7, which we've announced here at NAB 2011. So some of the new features of Div Archive version 7 are market share leading content storage management solution, our brand new user interface, so a full uh, graphical interface with a dashboard view that shows system utilization as well as trends of utilization. So really giving users a good view of what's, what the system is doing and how busy it is, and potentially identifying graphically bandwidth limitations and, and in issues within their system. We've also announced our support of the archive exchange format. So Front Porch Digital, as one of the founders of the SMPTE uh, AXF committee back in 2006, we've com completed a specification which uh, is a generic standardized way of actually uh, storing objects on storage media. And we're going to contribute that back to the SMPTE community in, in hopes of standardization. Uh, we've also introduced three new interfaces to Div Archive for our third-party partners and our customers. We have a Java interface, as well as a web services, which is WS as well as RESTful as well. And that's available for free to our customers that, uh, that use Div Archive. We've also enhanced our integration into Apple Final Cut Pro and Final Cut Server uh, with new native plugins, so uh, very easy to use for editors and, and, and journalists uh, using the, the Apple set of tools. Uh, certainly continued advancement of our Avid integration as well with the latest interplay uh, functionality for both DET as well as DHM archiving. And a special thing that we've done now in a Div Archive version 7 is we've added capabilities for DPX archiving as well. So taking the Div Archive product, which has been very, very broadcast centric, and bringing that out to film and film production environments. So being able to store uh, millions of files of DPX files per Div Archive object and having those replicated for disaster recovery across within one site and across as many sites as the customer has. So thank you very much, and for more information, you can visit us at uh, fpdigital.com. Thank you.